Welcome to the International Space Station. I'm astronaut Aki Hoshide. I'm astronaut Megan MacArthur. Today, we're going to discuss how engineers design space station modules so we can use the entire volume to live and work. What is volume? Glad you asked. Let's go check it out. Area is defined as the two-dimensional space occupied by a flat shape or surface of an object, whereas volume is the amount of space occupied inside a three-dimensional object. Length times width will give you the area of a square. Take the area of a square and multiply that by its height to get the volume of a cube. For example, here's a cube that is 2 meters long by 2 meters wide by 2 meters high. Multiply those dimensions and you get 8 cubic meters of volume. But that's only one way to calculate volume. Cones, cylinders, and spheres all have different formulas to calculate their volumes. To calculate the volume of a cylinder, we take the area of the circle, pi times the radius squared, and multiply that by the length of the cylinder. In the Destiny module, we have a pressurized volume of approximately 106 cubic meters, or 3,700 cubic feet. That's a lot of space for us to live and work. Destiny is the primary research lab for U.S. payloads, supporting a wide range of experiments and studies contributing to health, safety, and quality of life for people all over the world. Engineers designed these cylindrical modules for astronauts to utilize the entire three-dimensional space. So you've learned that Destiny is a cylindrical shaped pressurized module, but inside the space you can see that our interior space is a little bit more like a square. So these racks are designed to fit against the walls of the uh, circular cylindrical module, and so the back of the rack is curved and the front of the rack is straight. And so we can keep a variety of different kinds of experiments in different racks, and we can also use the ceiling and the floor just as easily as if it were a wall. So one of the places that we store some of our stuff is in the ceiling. You see we have these different kinds of bags that we store things in, in these different um, kinds of cupboards. We also can keep our medical kit up here out of the way. So if anybody um, gets a cut or a scrape or needs some medicine, we have different packs in here that have all the different things that we might need while we're up here. I can also use space in the floor. We actually have a window that's in our floor that looks straight down onto the earth. I hope you learned a little bit about the importance of engineering and utilizing volume aboard the space station today. Use the corresponding classroom connection to learn more about area and volume and challenge yourself to redesign your own home and classroom for life and microgravity. Maybe one day, you will be an engineer designing rooms for us up here in space. See you next time. Subscribe for more space.